This is the flag of Poland. And this is the political map of Poland. You can see Poland is bordered by so many countries. In the west it is Germany. A little southwest it is Czech Republic and then Slovakia. Further south it is Hungary. Then as you go up again towards north it's Ukraine. Then on the east it is Belarus. Then comes a little part of Lithuania. And finally in the north it is Kaliningrad Oblast of Russia. And finally in the north it is the Baltic Sea. In my previous videos you have already seen all the Baltic countries I have covered in my videos. Today my video will show you the city of Warsaw, the capital city of Poland. We are now touring in Poland. In my last video I had already shown you the beautiful city of Poznan. In this video, I'll cover part of the Warsaw city, mainly the Lazienki Park. Our bus has already started from Poznan. We will travel from Poznan to Warsaw now, which is around 320 kilometers. We are heading towards Warsaw. We are gradually approaching the city of Warsaw, which is the capital city of Poland. We are now passing by the garden side castle. You can see it is a majestic building. And this is Visla river. Warsaw is situated on the bank of this river. Finally, we reached the main city of Warsaw. We checked into the hotel. Next day morning, we are going out for the sightseeing of Warsaw. This is a bus and this is our local guide. Guide is briefing us about our city tour. We are now crossing the Visla River. This is the city hall of Warsaw. We are on a city tour of Warsaw.
in the front you can see that is the city center of Warsaw and this place contains all the modern architectures. The tall building which you can see is the palace of culture and science. We have now parked our bus and we will see the famous Lazienki Park now. Lazienki Park or Royal Baths Park is the largest park in Warsaw. This is the statue of Marshal Joseph. This Lazienki Park is visited by tourists from all over Poland and the world and serves as a venue for arts and culture. This is the Presidential Palace or the Palace of Belvedere Sky. This is Royal Lazienki Museum. Now this is the famous Chauvin Memorial. This is the statue of Chauvin or it is spelled as C-H-O-P-I-N. He was a genius in the field of music in Poland. He died very young at the age of 39 years. He has staged a concert at the age of 8 years only. So in his memory this architecture was built. The Frederick Schoffin Monument in Warsaw is a large bronze statue of Frederick Schoffin. It now stands in the upper part of the Royal Bath Spa. It is an outstanding sculpture by Mr. Waklaw. It is a 7 meter high sculpture made of bronze. This is a red squirrel which is very common in this park. Beautiful flowers have bloomed beside water body. Such a beautiful park. It looks so colorful. This is the biggest and the most beautiful park and one of the loveliest park locations in all of Europe. Lazienki Park was originally designed in the 17th century as a baths park for nobleman Stanislaw Lubomirski. And this is the summer residence of the Polish king or it's mainly known as Palace on the Isle. Lazienki Park, a favored residence of Polish royalty, was constructed between 1774 to 1784 at the command of King Stanislaw August. We will now enter the palace which is now a museum. The palace on the isle is one of the most valuable Polish historical buildings housing the royal picture gallery, the old orangery, housing the royal sculpture gallery with plaster copies of the most famous sculptures 
of the ancient world you can see the different paintings and stone sculptures they are marvelous Once a hunting ground, Lazienki was acquired by King Stanislaw in 1764 and transformed over the centuries to include a couple of palaces, an amphitheater, museums, and various follies. Great architectures. You can also see the beautiful lamp sheds hanging from the ceiling. We are now touring Lazian Key Park. In the 18th century, the park was transformed by Poland's last monarch, Stanislaus II, for palaces, villas, follies, and monuments. And in 1918, it was officially made as a public park. When we came out from the park, we saw that the Indian embassy is situated just near to the park. You can see the Indian flag there. After completing our tour of the park, we will now move to the old town of Warsaw. We have to now hurry to get into the bus. We will move to the old town. In my next video, see the rest part of our Warsaw tour. After seeing my videos, please do like, share and comment. And please do not forget to subscribe my channel.